Have you guys heard about this? This situation on Twitter with Fruit? Fruit the Lich, Lich VTuber, you probably know who she is. So I heard about this situation from Rev actually. Shout out to Rev, good guy. Apparently, Fruit posted these selfie pictures. And for the most part, they did go well, don't get me wrong. Rightfully so, they're good pictures. However, <laughs> that said, there's always that other side, isn't there? Because you actually got some people upset by this, saying that they're no longer a fan of hers or something, because this has broken their immersion. <laughs> their their immersion, first of all, immersion for what? What do you, what do you, you're, you're, you're watching her stream, you do realize there's a real person controlling the VTuber model, right? It's not literally an anime girl. <laughs> you, are you, you're, you're sitting there telling me you're trying to find immer like um, immersion. When I hear someone say immersion, I think of kind of like role playing in a, in a video game, right? Like you're playing Skyrim and you're kind of getting in the, the groove in the mood of being that character to a lesser extent. Sometimes immersion can just be getting in the mood, getting in the zone of the game, so to speak. Now I'm trying to apply this to a VTuber stream situation though. How does that work? Immersion. So are, is this person like, getting high or something trying to think like oh man yeah lich this is this is literally her she freaking exists in the computer i'm immersed i'm immersed in this stream man i don't know i don't know like don't get me wrong when i watch a vtuber i'm not sitting there thinking about them being the real person i am just enjoying the stream and watching them as a vtuber but ultimately i'm not trying to convince myself that they're not like they don't actually exist either so that's why this this whole thing confuses me man i'm trying to be fair and understand that whole immersion thing maybe there's something i'm missing um, it just seems weird in the context of getting upset at a VTuber for being a real person and saying that breaks immersion. Or in this particular situation, I suppose, what really upset them was having the picture posted. And you got other people being upset, saying she's like an e-thought desperate for followers or something because of this. And Rev made a great point in his video, which I, I totally agree with. Fruit is a very successful streamer, one of the top streamers for Apex, I believe. I've seen her tweet about that before. So this certainly isn't her like desperately trying to get followers. She probably felt like posting a selfie. Probably thought these were pretty good pictures. Kind of feel like posting them to the internet. So you know what? I'm going to post them to the internet. Back on that whole immersion thing. You know, she's like a goth girl in real life. Apparently, this is what she looks like in these pictures. If anything's going to not break immersion, that could be a selfie. This should be the situation, right? Like... She ain't that far off from her VTuber model. Of course, you know, green hair and all that short hair. But okay, point is, you got the goth girl. You got the lich. See what I'm getting at? All right, you get the point. Another example. With Coco, when everyone found out who her who, who she really is, right? We, we know what she looks like and all that from the streams that she's done. I mean, when I go back and rewatch Coco's streams, I'm not like sitting there jaded thinking, oh, now that I know what she looks like, this is just not fun. This is just so triggering. <laughs> like, what the heck? And again, when I do watch a VTuber streams, I'm not sitting there trying to think of what they look like in real life, despite knowing they're a real person. So I don't know, this whole situation is just kind of kind of weird. But I guess we talk about a lot of things like that here, don't we? Because the internet can be a can be a weird place, man. It really can be. Ultimately, if you're a VTuber, you don't got to post a selfie. I don't think most VTubers do post selfies, and that's totally fine by me. In this particular situation, though, I don't see the problem with, with Fruit posting a selfie. I don't... I don't see why people are upset with it. It's just weird. Especially the way they're phrasing it, too. I don't know. I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. I need some coffee. I need to get off the internet. I've got more segments to record first, though. <laughs> Let's get back to work. I'll get off the internet later today. Uh, I'll see you guys soon for the second segment of the day on the way.